I'm Kat Derry and I'm the All Blacks dietitian. When I first started it was very much a meat and three veg culture and due to the fact that people travel more we've got more um, interaction with um, different cultures in their diet and their and the way that they eat you know now they're exposed to um, Malaysian, Asian, um, Polynesian, Italian, French you know we have so many different cultures of food that we're exposed to now and so actually trying to meet the needs of all our players involves using a lot of those foods within the menu and so I work really closely with the chef to try and incorporate a lot of different types of food not only from the country that we're in but also ones that players are really familiar with. We have an advance party that goes early to the hotel and we will have um, put together a menu that meets the needs for the, the variety of players and then I will work with the chef around what each meal setup is going to look like and what our expectation will be. Mm -hmm. yes, if you yes. recall last time, just that bottom right. shelf just right. needs to be filled with Powerade right. and then we'll just keep that stopped up for Friday. We talk about soul food in this environment, so that's food that not necessarily meets the nutritional needs day to day, but actually gives you a feel good food. So it might be something like um, a cottage pie, which the boys really love. It might be putting sushi on, because a lot of the boys love sushi and sashimi. And so each day I'll try and mix it to not only meet the nutritional needs of the boys, and that includes a lot of vegetables, good fruits, really good quality meats, but also giving them feel-good foods that actually makes them think, oh yum, I can't wait to get to lunch and have that. I actually really enjoy going to different countries. I spend quite a bit of time browsing all the different food outlets and supermarkets so we can try and maximise some of the different strengths that in each country and um, keeps, it, keeps it fun. Oh, oh hello, 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 Vera, hello, hello, Vera. Oh, yeah, oh. Hello, Vera. <laughs> <laughs> that would be a really unusual flavour. Is it? It's really nice. Is it? Okay, yeah. I'll throw one in and see what happens. <laughs> We do have certain um, traditions that are important to the athlete because they look for the player because they look forward to it as part of their week. And so we have the same Friday night meal or the night before the game meal every week because that's a really important meal because it's part of the 48 hour preparation for a game. And so we do have lamb shanks and that's something that has um, been around for a very long time and how those are cooked and how those presented are very very important and I get rapid feedback if they're not right. And the other one we have is our pre-match meal is the boys love date scones. And not cheese scones, I've tried that once before and that was an epic fail, it did not go down well. So date scones with jam and cream. And it's become a custom that we have before our game for many years.